welcome back in today's video we will learn how to create and send custom notification using apex so let's start as you can see on the screen i have already logged in to my salesforce org you have to go to setup and search for custom notification click on custom notifications as the page load click on new and create a new notification type so i will name it push notification the api name will auto populate and for supported channels i will use both desktop and mobile and click save once you are done with creating custom notification type you have to open developer console so let's open developer console and open an anonymous window here we will write the code create custom notification and send it to user so first of all let's start with creating a custom notification object which is of custom notification type and is under messaging namespace so messaging dot custom notification let's give it a name custom notification obj equals to a new and again i will copy this part and paste it here now let's uh, find the user id so id user id equals to user info that dot get user id we need user id because we will send this custom notification to the logged in user after that i will set the body of the custom notification so let me copy this object name and let's set the body using this set body sort of so here set body method and here i will pass the body please check the case details now let's set the title so again i will paste the name of the object then i will use the set title method set title equals to uh let's give it case got escalated after that uh, let's search for custom notification type so custom notification type equals to let's run a soql query select id from custom notification type where developer name equals to push notification because when we created that custom notification we named it as a push notification now let uh, set the notification type id so custom notification object dot set uh, notification type id which will be a type dot id after that we will set the id of the sender so let's do that custom notification object object dot set uh, sender id and under this i will pass the user id variable now let's pass the target id on which record uh, this notification will take us so when we click on the notification it will uh, take us to the to a record so let's as we are working with case here so i will use the case id and when user click on that notification he, he will be or she will be redirected to this case record let's go back to our code and uh, write custom notification 
o p j dot set target id and we will pass the id of the case record after that we will send the custom notification o p j dot send and here we will create a set new set of type string and we will pass user id let's select this code and execute it as of now you can see there are no notifications here so let me execute this code and see if a notification will be visible or not as you can see on the screen here one notification is visible let's click on this case code has created it is generated a few seconds ago so let me click on this and it will take take me to the same case record as you can see on the screen we are on the case record so this is how you can create and send custom notification to a user in salesforce let me revise what we have just understood first of all you have created a custom notification type by searching custom notifications in setup after that we have gone to our developer console and wrote the code let me go to the code first of all we have used the custom notification class of messaging namespace and created a object of it after that we have find the user id then we have set some parameters or uh, of this custom notification object like body title notification type id sender target id and then we have used the send method to send the notification so that's it in this video we will learn more concept in the future video thank you very much